Welcome to Ill on our news. I'm Emily, E-M-I-L-Y, not I-E, because I-E's are ill. And here with me today, I have my BFF, Amber. Hi. Middle school thank you Thanksgiving Thursday is November 20th from 3.30 to 4.30 in the cafeteria. Bring food to come. Share. Ill. Ill. Okay, so the Costa Rica wind charm really wants to donate some pretty cool stuff to a local school in Costa Rica. So if you want to be like super nice and donate something, do it and just take it to the front office. So if you like don't know whether to take the SAT or the ACT, then like totally go to UVU um, Saturday, November 15th because sign up is free and you could totally take a practice test there and then ace the actual test. Ew. So just talk to your counselor if you want some more information. Ew. Ew. No food in the gym. Like, no. Ew. What's like, your problem? Oh my Pick gosh. Up your like, can't believe it. Why don't you just like, like trash and like this garbage, garbage piece of pizza like reason. pizza splashed all trash. over the freaking board. Like, What's your problem? Be respectful, away. guys. Oh my Ew. gosh. Ew. Oh. When you come into school, make sure your jackets are approved. Ew. Stay in uniform, Mazer. Yeah, Mazer. A cappella group auditions will be Friday, November 14th. <clears throat> In the choir room, prepare a song and write it on Mr. Simmons' office. Everyone can try it out. Ew. Middle school math team meets on Mondays in Mrs. Platt's room. And Fridays after school in Mrs. Christian's room, the math teacher is what they call her. Ew. And it's like four or five dollars. No, it's 45, you weirdo. Ew. Ew. And yeah, make sure you talk to Mrs. Plot or Eric Harding for more information. Our first competition is in a few weeks. So Ew. join now. Chris Hernandez. Cute. Really? Yeah. Okay, well it's a good thing because he's our pride. Ew. Yeah. Okay, I'm Chris Hernandez and that means I'm short, lovable, and good with the ladies. I want to get a 4.0 and be in student council and get high on roll each. Term. I just love this school a ton ever since I came here last year. So I've been trying to do my best at this school and it's really been a great experience. It's a lot of fun, I guess. It takes like a good student, I guess, because you have to have a 3.0 in middle school. And it's really cool because you get to kind of run the activities and get on the inside of what's happening. And I really enjoy it because, like, as treasurer, I get to count money, and I just really like counting money. I like Latin because I've never really grown up with another language, and Latin just makes so much sense and it's so logical. I want to go to college and get my master's degree for sure. I'm not really sure. I don't really have planned out what college, and I don't have planned out what I want to get my degree in. I just know I want to be pretty good in. I want to be a professional basketball player, I guess, or a professional baseball player. I like to play basketball, like, a lot. Um, I also play baseball. I just like how everyone is really tall in basketball, and people say that you can't be short, but look at me, I'm just a freaking beast. I like it so much because being short is really fun. Hearing all my friends say, you're so, like, good at, like, going to the room, I'm just like, yeah, I am, and like, I like just the feel of it, being on the court, and like, the exercise that you get out of it. I am right now in middle school boys basketball. I'm really excited about that. I'm gonna try out for the soccer team. I do drama, I did Shakespeare last year and this year. Um, I do the spring play. I like to cook and write, and stuff that involves activity. Big sense of humor to make people laugh and have fun with people. Um, I really like to make people smile with my jokes and stuff. So a very tired and distressed man walks into a bar and orders a strong beverage. The bartender asks, long day? The, the man replies, no, all days are 24 hours. Amazed at how stupid and uneducated the bartender is. I feel like court smelter. I am a size eight. The lack of respect for the species of pugs. That's really a big problem, guys. 
Pugs are the most amazing dog ever. You know why? Because they're so beautiful that their flat face and their face is just so beautiful because it's like a fist and it can punch people. Even though most people say like a pug probably ran into a wall or something. Even though they really are just flat faced and really cute, especially when they like run. See you next time, Neither. Ew. Ew. Oh, it's my stuffed up garret. Oh. Some funky announcements you got going on. Ew. Ew.